Good evening and welcome back to Stardew Valley. I'm Modia Baranis. We are in the throes of the last days of fall here. 13,000 bucks to our name also. Pretty fantastic. Uh, weather report for tomorrow. Welcome to KOZU. It's going to be rain. It's going to rain all day tomorrow. Oh, well, that would be perfect time to upgrade this. Except I believe it's the first day of winter anyways, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, hello. Hi, Modi. Beautiful day, isn't it? Uh, hey, Leah. What's up, man? I brought you a gift. Okay. It's a sculpture I've been working on, just for you. Oh, it's the one she's been working on this entire time! You know, you were working on that one before we I mean, met you. I mean, before we became friends, anyways. I think don't think that's true, exactly. But I appreciate the gesture. It's called How I Feel About Modi. I hope you like it. Um, yeah, that's going prominently in display in my house, for sh for sure. Uh, it's a centerpiece, I think, really. Uh, yeah, we're putting it, like, right prominently middle of the room conversation piece. I like it. Uh, okay, so it's gonna rain all day tomorrow. We could probably upgrade the watering can. Not that we'll need to use it anyways, because it's gonna be winter. But I think that it's the last day of fall tomorrow, so it may make sense just to do the upgrade for it. Do we have gold? That's the question. Oh, we need we need silver, or silver iron, iron. Uh, yeah, we can do that. Let's sell this off for one, one last harvest. Let's see how our apple tree came along. Cause it's supposed to take all month to grow. Hey, it's nearly grown. <gasps> oh, look at this! <gasps> it's the start of something big. We got our first oak resin, which means we can make our very first keg. Takes one off copper bar, one iron bar, clay, wood, oak resin. Oh, fantastic! Let's take a look and see if the other one's grown already too. We get two kegs going already? Oh man. Fermenting and pickling is gonna be our thing, I think, going forward here. Cause it's gonna be, oh uh, yes, two kegs going at once. Fantastic, we can get our first, our winter ale. Our winter ale, that'd be fantastic. Man, okay, what, what's gonna be our winter ale? Um, We have to get this going right now, right? Uh, we're not gonna worry about watering the crops today because, like I said, nothing's gonna grow. Uh, We need copper, we need sil iron, okay, not silver, I keep saying silver. Oh, we need to get more, more iron. Only got room for one, okay. Well, we can start with one and then make another one later. Here's some copper, got that at least. Oh, we also have the earth crystal for the, uh, we have that for our, um, what we're gonna make, mayonnaise machine, that's right, mayonnaise machine. Uh, earth crystal, stone, and wood, and copper again. Okay, let's get a copper cooking up here then. Uh, I don't think we have any bars made for it right now. Let's see, more copper there. Let's get that all going here. That'll cook up real quick. Um, yeah, cool. And then we'll need our wood out, and we'll need some stone. Wood and stone. We might need more wood, actually. Oh, there's one copper right there. Nice. Uh, excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, I think that should be everything we need. Okay, so first thing we'll make is the man is machine. We've been waiting on that for a long time. And uh, we can't neglect our animals today, too. Even though we're not watering our crops, the animals will still produce eggs for us. Uh, okay, yeah, let's... Can we take this stuff out over here? Can't get rid of, the, we can't get rid of these bushes, unfortunately. All right, so this might not be the best spot to put all this stuff. We might have to have a better spot for this kind of thing later. Um, okay, so, man is machine. Requires an egg. Let's go get ourselves an egg from our chickens. It looks like also, if we leave this door closed, they do go back inside the next day. So it kind of is a, a thing we open it up, they can come out. They're happier when they're outside. All right, and we'll grab the egg. They only produced one. Something must be wrong. They must not like it right here very much yet. I mean, their levels are pretty low still. They're not the happiest chickens ever. But that's the beginning. It's the beginning. You know, we'll have, we'll have all winter to get to get to know them better. I hope they like going out in the cold. I hope they don't mind the snow. Okay. And then, uh, we'll chop down a little bit of the grass. I think we actually do have one more day of, uh, fall here before the end of the month, though. So we'll, uh, we'll probably wrap that up this episode, unless this... Oh, look at this corn! One last harvest! Now, the, the event that we're waiting on here does take, uh... This is until the evening, I believe. So it is 
Spirit's Eve, it's called, I believe. Um, it is the winter or the fall uh, Stardew Valley equivalent of uh, Halloween, I believe. Um, we need to get a present to Leah still, which after she gave us something great, we should give her something great too. Let's get this egg cooking up. I don't know how long that takes, we'll find out. Uh, and then uh, we got that going, we need to get one iron and get our first keg going. Let's see, what else do we need? Clay. And we have one clay. So, let's get our first ale cooking up here first. Uh, let's put this here, make sense? There. And we'll actually get our first hops in there. Um, and now we have all the starred stuff. I'm thinking maybe it's not gonna matter if it's starred or not, but we'll try our starred one and see how good if we can make a really good thing right away here. Make some starred brew, and this will be for Pam, I believe, is the first one. Pam is thirsty. Bring Pam an ale. Cool. So, we're making ourselves some ale. We got some, can't, man, we're just getting to be all kinds of productive around here. We might have to set up a different spot for this stuff. Um, maybe on the side over here? I don't know, maybe put it all over on this side instead of that side? Perhaps? I'm not sure. But we'll think about that later. As I said, we're not going to water anything today. Uh, we'll take our copper, we'll take our iron, rather and go talk to Clint. If we, if we even can today, we might not be able to even get access to that area of town because it might all be closed off for the festival. So, um, I'll hang, let's hang on to this, let's hang on to this for now, let's hang on to that for now. Let's take the salad in case we run into Leah, and we'll see if we can get into town. I don't think we can, actually, now I'm thinking about it. We'll see what it says. It might limit our options as far as what we want to do today, then. Um, if it is not letting us go into town, Festival's being set up, okay. So we can't go into town at all today, so that means we can't drop off a watering can, so we'll have to wait till the winter to upgrade that. Uh, we'll need more iron, though, clearly, um, because we need to get all kinds of stuff now related to that. Uh, so let's go back to the mines maybe today and maybe get more iron, go to the higher up levels. We did make the level 100 last time. Uh, we'll go to the higher up levels, though, this time and look for more iron tier stuff. And um, we'll leave this behind. We won't need it. We'll hang on to that in case we run into Leah. I don't know if we will. Let's swing past her house, actually, while we're out and about here. The other thing we could do for uh, a fun activity would be go to the, the hidden forest and get some hardwood. Um, I don't know. If we don't really have a need for hardwood right now. I think we will need hardwood if we want to upgrade the house further, though. I haven't checked what Robin's requirements are. But we might be able to get to Robin's house if we go from the north and then go down, that might work. Hello, how's it going? Decoration accents the, accentu decorations accentuate the feeling of the season. I think it's a worthwhile tradition. Yeah, I agree. Um, here's your salad for the day. Oh, this is exactly what I wanted, thank you. Of course, oh, she's making a, she's making a sculpture that's identical to the one she just gave us. I mean, it can't possibly be. One of the sculptures Leah's working on has a wonderful cedar smell. Yeah, that can't possibly be true. What you told me about that one. I mean, I don't, I don't think any less of her, but it can't possibly be true. She's making an identical one right now. We're just cheering it out. Turn them out. All right, so let's get up to the mines here quick and see if we can get some more iron today as our, one of our main goals. Uh, and we're not going to spend all day there, but we have a lot of energy to burn through, and we're not going to use it all for the event tonight. Um, you know, it's all, it's Spirit's Eve. It should have, like, costumes or something like that. I hope there's a costume contest or something, at least, to that effect. Oh, well, we'll see. Puppy? Um, oh, I didn't water the dog. Shoot. One thing we gotta do always, water the dog. I can't get through that way. Uh, where's my watering can? Can't forget about the poochie, right? And it's gonna be out of water, of course. There we go. We're wasting a whole lot of time just watering this poochie. But he's worth it. There we go. Oh, I can hear his tail wagging. That's always the best, when a, a dog's tail wags so hard you can hear it thumping on the ground. It's good stuff. Okay, so, I mean, I guess, I don't know, I was gonna say, we could water the cranberries once more, but I don't think they're gonna grow again. It, we harvested it too recently. So, we won't worry about that. Uh, next time we do cranberries, though, we're definitely gonna put on the quick soil on those and see if we can get them growing even faster each season. More growth, more profit. Even if they're not quality, they still sell for a ton. 
So here we go. Hey, Linus, how you doing, man? I have everything I need to survive and more. Nature plays a wonderful tune if you listen. If you only learn to listen. Let's go talk to Robin and see if she's open. First of all, here. Hey, how's it going? Uh, I'm interested in upgrading the house again. Fifty grand to upgrade the house and 150 pieces of hardwood. No, thank you. But that'll be way down the road then. Farm buildings. Let's take what animals here. Four barn dwelling animals. Uh, for six thousand gold, we have enough for that. 350 wood don't have that in stone, okay? And a well silo stable for a horse. Oh man, 100 hardwood. Horse included though. Horse included for 10 grand. Oh my god. And then this. Quite expensive. I don't know where we'd put it on the farm, but we definitely want to get uh, a slime a slime hatch for sure. That sounds like a great idea. Iridium we don't have yet though, so we can't do that either. All right, well we got at least a roadmap of where we can go with this. Um, also get the plasma TV eventually too, because why not, right? That's what farmers do: sit around watching their plasma screen TVs. Anywho, let's get down there, get a couple of iron, hopefully get a, a couple lucrative veins of it, and then uh, head back to the event tonight. Hopefully, we don't get killed on our way down there. Of course, we're going to the higher up levels. So, where do you think iron started? Let's say 50. Yeah, this looks like a good iron spot. There's also copper here, too. Oh, there's a lot of iron here. Oh, and the enemies die quick, so this won't be an issue. All right, we got two, we got five. Oops, not that. Nice. Um, yeah, this is actually a good spot because we can get copper and iron here. And uh, I checked the quest lines through Gil the other day here. Winter Root, interesting. That's our first time we've gotten uh, Winter Root as a drop here. It's a little premature, I think, actually. Not winter yet. Um, yeah, grab all this we can. Grab to seven. Another two. Um, once the, uh... Once the event happens, we'll we'll take the uh, the railway over to either the the bus station or the town if it lets us, and then we'll save some time getting back. Ooh, what do we got here? Nice, twelve. Okay, that's at least two bars. Nope, nothing we can do about that. These guys drop coal, which is nice. Always need more of that. They do not very much damage either. And there is a quest line to destroy those kind of guys, as I was trying to say before. Um, so we need to do this anyways, if we want to progress through that line. Cave carrot. Need that. Oh, look at this big vein here. Oh, we're gonna have a bat problem on our hands in a second. Here we go. A oh, one shot. That's not bad. A lot of bat wing too, and a bomb. Fantastic. Nice. I don't know if there's a quest to kill bats or not. I'm sure there is. Maybe we've already gotten it though. It's possible that we already finished that one. Aquamarine. 6.30 p.m. I think this thing starts at 10. One of, the, one of these late night events. Um, do we want either a bomb? We never tried one of these before. They, they probably blow up even bigger than the other ones do. The other ones were pretty big already. Wow, more cave carrots, awesome. Uh, let's save it for now. We'll use it maybe next floor. Not that we need to get down further floors. Uh, we have 42 iron, so the mission accomplished as far as that goes, so far. Um, I think this is the last level we'll need to do for this, though. Ooh, look at that. We got a frozen geo just for... What is this guy all about? He 
He dropped something good. Oh, he dropped a lead rod. Oh, okay. Yeah, we've gotten that from that guy before. <gasps> Is that the one we needed? I don't think so. I think we need three. Could be wrong, though. Artifacts. We have one, two, and three. We need four. Okay. Well, this is a good thing to do, too. We should do this every once in a while, just to go to higher levels or, or higher up levels in the mine and uh, farm some, like, things like that. They can drop on any level. Of course, I don't know if the four can drop on any level. Maybe, maybe we have to get down deeper for that one to drop. But at some point, we'll be high enough level we can just, you know, do the combat pretty easily everywhere. I don't know how much harder these things get. Hopefully a little bit harder. You know, I kind of want a challenge out of this, not necessarily just have a, us walk over everything. Then again, I mean, farming's not difficult to do, so maybe it's not all about the challenge of it. It's already 9 p.m., jeez. Alright, um... One more guy here. Let's get down lower and see if there's anything else before we can need to wrap it up here. We've only got with things once from that, uh, those crystals in the ground here. Whoa! Crystal fruit! Holy cow! Crystal fruit, delicate fruit that pops up from the snow. Oh, is this one of the things we need to forge for? That's a fruit. It's not a forage thing, though. Quality crops, spring, animal. No? Not too sure. Oh. Oh, I didn't realize we could do this. Yeah, we can get this done. We need all five of these things, though. Wool, goat milk, duck egg, and large milk. Okay. Well, to complete that quest line, we need to get one of each animal, then. Basically. I didn't forget about that part. Uh, bulletin board, no, winter forage, winter forage, yes, there it is, okay, cool, so we're halfway there with that quest line, and, uh, let's get down deeper, oh boy, okay, we can do one more of these then, oop, it's starting, okay, let's get out of here then, let's go back to the event, we don't want to miss it, uh, leave the mine, can we take this into town then, well, let's leave these here quick too, uh, bam, bam, Take the rest with us. Take these with us. Cool. All right, let's head back out. And the town. Nice. Cool. Oh, it drops us off here. That's nice. Hello, kids. But Aunt Marnie, I want to go to the maze. I'm not scared. Hi, Modi. Have you had a productive fall? I have. I really have. Um, we're the we're richer now than we ever were before. I mean, that's the productive fall to me. Eek, I'm too scared, says Haley. Haley, Haley, Haley. Shop. Ooh, jack-o'-lantern. 750 or a recipe. Oh, man, or a rare crow. Tempting, tempting. I think we'll save that for a later, later year. Oh, okay, we'll go up there in a minute. That looks like the maze. Oh, I got skeletons. Don't get too close to the cage. I have no idea how these skeletons are walking. Creepy. Why is there no more pumpkin ale? I don't know, man. I just got here. One of my iridium-infused maces would make quick work of these things. Yeah, where, do, where can I get one of those from you, buddy? Leah? Mm, hi, sorry. Mouthful of blackberries. Okay. Not much for conversation, then. Do you like the jack-o'-lanterns? I carved them myself. They're really cool looking, actually. Well done. I get scared very easily. I'll leave the haunted maze to the younger people. Vincent's upset that I won't let him go into the haunted maze, but he's just a little boy. I'll come to any event with free grub. You won't see me in the haunted maze, though. Nobody wants to go in the haunted maze. Everyone's scared. It's a lot of fun to cook with pumpkin. Such an interesting fruit. It is. It is. A lot of people throw pumpkin into everything nowadays. Why, hello, Modi. It's chilly, isn't it? Well, you're all business, aren't you? Well, winter's almost here. It's a great time to stockpile wood and stone. That's probably true. I haven't seen Maru in hours. I hope she's all right. Oh, no, she's lost in the maze. We should find her. Uh, let's see. Here's a Vincent. Mother won't let me go in the maze. Aw, oh, boo-hoo. 
Good evening, Modi. Have you ventured into the haunted maze yet? It's quite spooky. Hmm, okay, we gotta do it then. Everyone else is gonna think we're a coward if we don't. You know who I don't see out here? Willie. Of course Willie's in the maze. He went up there. That's the first thing. He's the guy is he's like running it. He owns the maze probably. Who else are we missing? Uh, we're missing Alex. He's in the maze for, for sure. Maru is in the maze. Who else can we find? Hmm. Sebastian's not. Sam's probably in the maze. Yeah, Sam's in there. Okay, let's go take a look. The haunted maze. Oh, there's Maru. I think I've already been this way. No, wait. This guy's just lost in here. Oh, you found me. Oh, Harvey. The truth is I got too scared, so I came in here to hide. Don't tell anyone. There's a pumpkin over here. Or a jack-o'-lantern. Can't grab it. Oh, look at the spider. That's cool. Um, let's see. Oh, look at this! Oh, that's cool. Little hands that grab ya. Uh-huh. That's supposed to be scary? I don't know. Oh, Penny's in the maze. Hey, let's go talk to her. What does she got? The vapor from his cauldron. It's making my head spin, but I can't seem to leave. Oh, there's a chest back there. We can only get to it. Oh, there's... The, oh, look at this. The hands. There's hands taken from underneath this house. Either it's walking around on hands... Oh, no, it's walking around on chicken legs. This house has chicken legs. I get it. Okay. <laughs> um... Is that a thing? Houses with chicken legs? I feel like I saw that in an episode of Scooby-Doo recently. My kid loves watching Scooby-Doo. Uh, the newer version, the, the 2012 version or something like that. And there was a chicken with... There was a house with chicken legs in it. I wonder if that's a thing. There's something weird over here. How do I get to it? That's a good question. We have to find a way in. Looks like there's a cave entrance there. So we have to find a way into a cave. Um, okay. I can't go on. Spiders. Oh, yeah. Gotta be brave. Gotta be brave, Abigail. Can't be scared of spiders. Ooh, there's a sign here. The playgrounds have converted into a graveyard here. That's odd. It was just a dead end up ahead. Hmm. Aha, it's not a dead end at all. You gotta be smarter than the hedge, buddy. That's the trick. That's how I do it. And? Look at these guys. Hanging out, of course. And? Go golden pumpkin! You received a golden pumpkin! What does it do? It's valuable, has no other purpose. Oh, we can sell it off for money! Oh! Well, this year we might do that, because we're still strapped for cash, but eventually maybe we'll just keep them as decorations. Oh boy. So cool. Anyways, I think that might do it for the, the, the Spirit's Eve here. Cool event! I do like it. Um, not as neat as the... Oh wait, who's walking in there? Who's that walking there? It's Alex? Yeah, it's Alex. Hey, bud. There's gotta be a secret passage around here. Yeah, not right here, but somewhere. You keep trying, buddy. You keep trying. As I said, you gotta be smarter than the hedge mage. Hedge mage. Hedge, hedge maze. Oh, boy. Words. Um, so is this one of those events where you just kind of wander off when we're done? The deal? Let's talk to him at the shop here quick. Can we sell it off? We can't. Okay, so we can't sell it to him. He's not prepared to make that kind of deal today. Oh, we didn't talk to Jody. Oh, we did, we did, we did, we did. I guess it, it's been a long time since I talked to her. We never see her around anywhere. She probably doesn't like us too much. Uh, that strange man who lives in the tower set it all up himself. He wouldn't let anyone near while he's working on it. Oh, okay. Where is he? That's a good question. Where's Rasmodius? That's who has to be, that has to be who he's talking about, the strange man who lives in the tower. Uh, he's not here though, nowhere to be found. He wasn't up there, he was, uh... Was it Rasmodius up there? Let's take a look real quick. It was, it was Willy and somebody else. I don't know, it doesn't matter. We can go back out. I don't think Rasmodius is here. I think up there it was, the, was it? Oh, you know who it was? I wonder if it's the rain guy, the poncho guy or whatever. His, his deal, let's call him poncho guy because he just reminds me. He looks like he's wearing a sombrero and a poncho. Um, and just laying out in the rain. He might just be wearing a hat too, like a... Like a cowboy hat, possibly. Something like that. Let's go take a look and see who's up there. 
Oh, can't go that way around spider. Who is it? Who's it gonna be? Um, I can't see him from here. Let's go, let's go around. I can, it says I can talk to them, but I really can't. There's nobody up there to talk to them though. So it is, oh, it's Linus and Rasmodius. There he is, okay. They're in the know. So who is in here? Willie's not here then. Willie's not into Spirit Thief, okay. Well, that's his own prerogative, I guess. Then again, maybe he got lost, or maybe he got scared. Oh no, what if what if what if we have our hero and are built up in our mind too much? And poor Willie came into the maze and saw the spider and two seconds later ran screaming out. Could happen. Could happen. Probably not. Probably not. Um, okay, so let's just get out of here. I think that's probably gonna do it for Spirit's Eve here. And likely for this episode, because it's running a little bit long here. And uh, trying to get the last day of fall in. I don't know, maybe we can do it. Eh, we'll probably want to take our time on it. And make sure we got everything prepared before the long winter sets in. So, I guess we just wander off then. When we're done, see you guys. Thanks for a great show. We'll see you. Leave the festival. Yep, let's do it. So we got this, uh, this golden pumpkin here. We also got this crystal fruit we'll drop off. Um, we don't know what we can do with this uh, scroll here. We have a bunch of scrolls. We'll hang on to those for now. Uh, drop the ore off in here. And we'll have some geodes to break open soon. Boy, oh boy. Can we sell this off? I think we sell this off, right? Um, can we sell this off? I don't think we can. Wait, man, I gotta get a second chest going, a third chest going. This we can sell off, that we can sell off, and this we'll sell off. And we'll see if we can sell this off. This has a recipe, I believe, so we don't want to use that. Um, and... Anything else? No, everything else we want to keep, I think. All right, let's go drop this stuff off and then call it an episode. Oh, we got some some uh, pickled bok choy and mayonnaise, too. So the mayonnaise took less than a day to grow. Uh, the bok choy will sell off and see how much we can get for that. And then we'll also go start that up again with more bok choy in there. Um, I think we started this all about the same time. So uh, the bok choy and the fruit. So it might be that the pickled stuff takes doesn't take as long as other stuff does. Or it might be related to how long the other thing takes to grow. Anyways, let's drop this stuff off in here. Let's sell this off. Yes, yes, and yes. And then we'll call it an episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. A second to last day of fall done here. We'll be back for the end of fall next episode and the beginning of, of winter next episode. So thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Stardew Valley. And I'll see you guys next time. Have a good night.